see how tight this thing is. That's about tolerance spec. How's it going everybody? Today, we're going to do a axle on a shuttle wagon. This one got ruined in the pinion. Sorry for it's being loud here, but uh, this is what we got going. Ugh. I got this loaded up, brand new axle. The last one I did, I rebuilt in the field with the ruined third member. Let's go take a look. So, see the bearing's basically missing out of it. I have rebuilt these before, but they weren't available, but a whole axle was available. So we're gonna start by locking up the main part of the chassis, uh, take the tires off, drive shaft off, get the jack in place. We'll start taking off the axle mounts, uh, brake lines, we should be able to drop it out. So, let's go ahead and get started. This will kill the remote because this is a remote controlled train. Toys for the big boys. There's our main lockout. Hey, okay, got that locked out. Gotta go make sure that we are definitely locked out. Yep completely dead so we're good to go there I'm gonna start getting my blocks out here I get the front end or rear end rear end of this jacked up high enough that our tires are off the ground we got the tires removed sandboxes removed so that way we get the tires off this thing weighs oh 1500 pounds so hopefully I can get it dropped down and wheeled out of there I can get it on the whole machine getting those tires just barely in the air I'm taking them off anyways but I gotta get the machine blocked underneath that piece of counterweight
guy is blocked up. Some fairly hefty blocks all the way secured underneath the axle. I'm just gonna leave the jack in place for no reason to really take it out, but you never want to trust your life to a jack because it's a 30 cent o-ring holding this thing together. Okay, now I got it all blocked in the air. We're gonna let the jack down on it. And we're gonna let it down to where the jack comes away. Like that and then I leave the jack in place so I'm gonna run it back up to where it just touches and I'm hand jacking it just where it touches so there we go together get it in a position get underneath here best I can support the pumpkin and then I'll drop those uh, bolts out uh, I already got the brake lines taken care of that's quite literally all that's holding this in there so as soon as I get that jack put together 
We can start dropping this sucker out of here. Okay. I'm back. I got a strap on here. Got the chain on this side. I'm gonna go ahead and start taking these. Right here, I set it down so I can readjust how I choke the axle. Uh, that way, I, when I pick it back up, I can orient it more flat when I put it on the jack.
got the tires back on. Brakes bled. So I could probably put this back together. Probably gonna leak just a little bit. I'm a little over full. You gotta clean that up, but that's good. Get this off the block. I just need to take it for a test ride. All right, guys. All done. Yep. All I can say is she is fixed.